Hey y'all, welcome to Heritage Homestead Journey. And we've got something that we were told that we had to try when we were in Chicago. So hang on to see what we're talking about. Hey y'all, I'm Mr. Patient. I'm Miss Katie. I'm John Boy. I'm Little Miss Homemaker. And I'm <laughs> And I'm Little Music Man. Yes. Hey, and right now we're in the Chicago land area. And as you well know, or you might not know, but when we're in a particular areas, we like to really um, focus on the food of that area. Um, what's the term I need to use? Well, regional specialties. There you go. We like to focus on regional specialties. And, and one of the regional specialties we had last night was Giordano's Pizza. And we had heard about something else... And we ask our waitress about it, and she says, oh, if you're in Chicago, you have to get Garrett's Popcorn. And she went further to say, not only do you have to get Garrett Popcorn, but you have to get the Chicago Mix. Well, the Chicago Mix is a mix of half cheddar popcorn and half caramel corn. So we've got some here, and uh, I mean... I, I know I'm going to like it because I like caramel corn and I like cheddar corn, you know, because a lot of you guys may have gotten those three-way popcorns where it's like regular popcorn, cheddar popcorn, and caramel popcorn in a in a tin like for Christmas or something. See, I love that stuff. And uh, so I know if they say this is the popcorn to get, then I know I'm going to like it. We're all going to try it and we're going to um, tell what we think about it. Um, now, two or three people did tell us we have to try this. That's and when I was told, we were told this, I kind of made a face. And I'm thinking, cheese and caramel together, but... Well, not only, anyway. not only two people, but when we were sitting there at Giordano's eating our pizza, the manager was talking to a table beside us and told them they needed to get the Chicago Mix Garrett's popcorn as well. So that was right. three people... Within about two hours, it told us you have to do this because it's it is a it's a really good regional specialty mix. Mix, mix or whatever. Garrett popcorn. So I poured out of this bag here. I poured what's here, and we're gonna try it. Speaking of Giordano's, I'm gonna go ahead and put a clip in here that I made of him last night. Mm. It is another thing that people say you have to eat here is deep dish pizza, and yes, deep dish pizza is very good. We no doubt about that. But we're just going to let you see in this little clip here what he thinks about Giordano's pizza. And then we'll come back and tell you what we think about this popcorn blend. For real now, be honest, I'm serious. <laughs> Compare this Chicago deep dish pizza in Chicago here at Navy Pier, Giordano's, to my recipe on YouTube, which is one of my top... Videos. Yeah, I think yours is better. I think no, just say no that. I, I feel like yours has more flavor than this does. I mean, the one we got has sausage, peppers, onions, and mushrooms. But like I said, I, yours seems to have more flavor. Well, I like mine a whole lot. I do too. And I especially like it when I make it with fine corn flour, which I do a lot. And, and I'm just saying I like mine better too. Is that we ought not say that about authentic Chicago deep dish pizza. But we're saying it. That's what we think is true. Alright. Okay, the recipe's on YouTube. Should they check it out, little miss? Yeah. How do you you this like I mean this is good, but yours is still better. Alright. Plus, I think yours has more crunch on the bottom. Mine has more crunch on the bottom. Yeah, I do like the crunch. Alright, thank you. So, now that's what he really thinks. Yep. I mean... It is. It's, it's, it's the truth. I mean, I, and I agree. I do like my recipe better. I do um, too. It's, it's on YouTube on Heritage Ways. Not this channel, but Heritage Ways. I have a part one and a part two of the deep dish pizza. And it's one of my... Um, close to the top for viewed videos and so apparently a lot of people 
Uh, one person started following us a couple years ago, just be or years ago, just because they love that recipe so much. Uh, so you'll find that recipe there, and it's also in my cookbook, which you can buy from heritageways.com. You can buy the cookbook with that written in it. Okay, so now we've we know about the pizza. We know what we think. We know we can keep traveling, and I can still make that pizza. So is this going to be as disappointing, you know, as that? All right, so what the lady said to do is she said to put a caramel and cheese in your mouth at the same time. All right, so go ahead and do that. Chew it up, and then we're going to ask you in a little bit what you think about it. And you don't have to like it. It's okay. And little, oh, come here. At least you're going to sit here with us in the video. You don't, he, he doesn't even want to try it. So <clears throat> he's hiding from the fact that that he uh, has to try it. Did you you put two cheese in your mouth at one time? You're supposed to put. You didn't. Okay. Mm. Can I go um, mess with the fish? Mm -mm. Well. Um. Okay. What do you think? Awesome. It's delicious, except especially since I love popcorn. <laughs> I love popcorn too, especially. It's really good. I don't love popcorn, but I have to say, the blend. Okay, the popcorn itself is good individually. In the blend, what do you think about it? I can take or leave the blend. I prefer, I mean, this is just me personally. I prefer eating them individually, the cheddar or the caramel corn. That's just me. It's not as weird as I thought it would be. Oh, well, it's not weird. So, in fact, it's, just it's a, kind of addictive. It's just that I like... <laughs> I mean, I like the flavor of the cheese by itself and then the flavor of the caramel by itself. I mean, I like the flavor of a mix, but I, I don't know. So, we like it. We like the popcorn. We're glad we bought it, right? What did you think? Um, I like them together, but I, I still like them separate. Like... Well, I think it's kind of obvious we like the popcorn. I even like the popcorn. Well, it's kind of hard to go wrong with yeah. caramel corn and cheddar corn. Thanks for watching. <laughs> Hit the subscribe button. We know we haven't made as many videos lately as we had been, but we're going through. Y'all hear those Canadian geese? That's awesome. Well, there's a lot of them. Oh, there sure is. We're going through a big season of change and decision making and all that. So just, we appreciate your grace and patience. And stay tuned. Make sure you go over and visit us at the Heritage Ways channel. We'll let the geese close us out. That's a lot of geese. Thanks for watching this video, y'all. And we just want to tell you, we really appreciate the heritage of so many, um, not only people and friends we meet, but places and restaurants and food establishments and, and, and businesses. This has been a Chicago, um, part of Chicago's heritage since 1949. Now, for some of us, that's not a whole long time, but that's still a long time to be in business. And we're so uh, thankful for heritage companies um this is not an ad and we are not being sponsored but if you're interested in ordering from garrett's popcorn then um, we'll put i'll put down below in the description box where you can find them but uh, it says here you can find them at at garrett popcorn facebook twitter and instagram and by the way i love that there's it's non-gmo corn and it's preservative free so that sounds like an ad, but it's not. Just wanted to um, thank you for watching the video. And just remember how important heritage is to all of us. So remember that everybody has a story. Take time to listen to somebody's story today. Thanks, y'all. See you next time.